So in the submitted ticket flow, let's go and start building this out. So first off, we want some messages to confirm. We need a few pieces of information. Now we want to start capturing information. Because we want to capture a specific piece of information, this is where we use the capture step. So in listen, capture, I'm going to drag this out. And you can see there's a couple different things you can do. The first one is capture the entire user reply and save it to a variable. Now, I want to create a variable called email. So let's create a new variable here. We'll call this email. And we're just going to say that this is the customer's email. Great. Let's just create a message step here to show you what that looks like. So now if I just run test from here and we say Daniel voiceflow.com, it's going to actually show me Daniel. Now we want to repeat this pattern to get the pieces of information that we need. So the next one is going to be, please describe your issue. We're going to do the same thing, capture step, and we're just going to capture the entire reply. And now we're going to create a variable called issue, customer's issue. And we're pretty much done here. We don't need any other information. You could collect it, but this would be the way to do it is just ask for a piece of information and capture it to a variable. And now what we want to do is actually send this over to Zendesk. 